Hey, Linux, Ubuntu, photographer people. Um, I just had a really successful and easy experience using the trial version of Portrait Pro. And uh, under Ubuntu latest, it's June uh, 2017 right now, so latest Ubuntu. Um, I, I just worked under Wine with the Windows 64-bit version. So I am using Wine 1.6.2, which is the latest version in my repository. Uh, and here's what I did. I'm gonna this. I've just purchased the Pro Studio version, so I'm going to install that in the same way that I installed the Portrait Pro version. I tried Landscape Pro, which is another of their products, and it was a complete fail. Did not work at all. So let's see. So Wine Portrait Studio setup. Let's see what happens. So it's installing it in a different path. So I'm going to end up with the trial and the pro studio version. I chose the studio version because what is this? Photoshop plugin installer. No, I don't have Photoshop. So launch it. Manual activation. Uh, ah, I'm going to have to pause this recording. Okay, so. I put in my license and it worked. I paused it so that you can see my license key. Now I did have one problem with the trial version, which is here's here's what's kind of sucky. So this, if I go to my pictures, this is weird. I have to show all files to see even .jpgs, whereas it says all supported files does not work. And even this is kind of crappy because there's no thumbnail preview so clearly we want to be able to just open it up natively um, from from Ubuntu but let's see anyway is that let's just make sure it works by selecting a file it does that step hung for me a couple of times and I'll show you what I did with that. So there's the product. Um, there's definitely times when I want a photoshopped look or the touch up is actually really good. Um, so it's a good product. So let's, let's do some, let's check something else. So I'm going to exit from that. Discard. I'm going to go to Nautilus. I'm going to right click open with that is, I believe, the trial. Or is it? No, it's not the trial. So it's reused the same shortcut. And I used, got that working originally just by, well, it's doing something behind the scenes that it doesn't like or not, maybe unrelated. Um, so I originally, Portrait Pro was just available in all applications. So I guess that's something Wine takes care of for us. Um, I did though have a problem in that when I was opening from here, it would stall halfway through and it would just die. Uh, let me show you what I did with that. And actually, maybe it still dies. No, it won't. So in the settings, there's this automatically find gender and age. What I was finding was when I was opening straight from Ubuntu from here, I was finding it would get through the finding the face, but then when it brought up the next dialogue, which is, is this a child, female, male? It would just totally freeze. 
um, by making it automatically do that step, um, it just works. So you might have to do that if you find a problem. But this seems to work. Let's make sure it saves. Uh, file settings. Make sure it doesn't save over. Don't save over originals. If this saves natively, which the demo doesn't. Uh, what if I just save? Yeah, that's the same location, which is great. Is it actually saving? Seems to be. Yeah, sweet. So it seems to totally work under under Ubuntu, under Wine, which is really awesome. Uh, what I'd really like to do now is work out how I can make it open from GIMP, or how I can work out how to use command line stuff. There must be a there must be switches in the command line for that executable. I don't know what else to say. It just seems to work. Um, I haven't changed any settings in Wine config, so it's using Windows XP, which I don't think the application. I don't think Portrait Pro says it should work under Windows XP, but it works. What else? I think that is about it. So very happy with that. Um, I'll use this once in a while as part of my workflow. Uh, that's about it. Have a good one.